Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel and another episode of Inheritance. So I figure we're going to just jump straight into a battle today. So uh, I was having a look in the command center. There's a few things I was interested in. This one I was kind of interested in, but because we've only got three mechs and our pilots are new, um, it would be attacking a Comstar forces, and I'm not really sure we're quite ready for that yet, but this one looks kind of interesting here. An escort mission through the jungle. Um, so I think this is going to be okay. I, I can't see who it is. Um, doesn't say who we'd be going against here. Let's have a quick look here. Um, let's go full salvage on this. We're still doing okay for money. We need gear is what we need. So let's go salvage. Um, and then uh, yeah. I think that's it. Well, that's the one. That's two. Sorry, it's been a little while since I recorded. Um, yeah, let's go. Command interface initiated. Alright, here we go. Friendly units under fire. Let's see if they're actually under fire. Because I've been noticing... Oh, they are actually. Okay, good. Uh, there's been a few missions where I've actually taken that were escorts that there were no escorts that I could drop right on the escort zone, but that is not the case here. So we're going to drop on this side and approach the road this way because we're going to escort them down this way over here. Now this is exotic. Is it? Right? Is it? I don't know. Yes, Commander. Order. Alright, taser face. Let's go see what we're up against here. What do we got here? So this is a one and a half skull mission. So that's a treb. Yep, trebuchet. Looking rather large though. Maybe it's just me. Um, let's get you... I'm going to put you like right in here. We want to see the enemy but not expose yet. Holding off. All right, not bad. Four chevrons. Yeah, we're probably not going to get sensors on these guys until after this first move. That's all right. So they got somebody going on 20. So most most likely a light mech somewhere. That's interesting. Mortars or I'm here. Uh, I, I bet it's a cyclone with um, thunderbolts. Uh, we'll get the Ares up here though. Okay. I don't think the trebuchet's got amazing back armor. We might get lucky and get a couple crits on this guy. Yeah, or maybe not. If you say so. He's already got some leg damage. Maybe it'll make him think that he needs to get the hell out of the way. And he won't turn to fight. Highly unlikely, but you never know. I've noticed that sometimes when you put the uh, the heat on to a mech early, it'll just run away at first. Not this guy, though. Waiting on you, Commander. All right, Griff. So, he's partially hidden. Well, let's get up here. Going turbo. We got the speed. Might as well use it. Ooh, we got somebody else down here. So, yeah, it was a cyclone. Wow, all cyclones. That's interesting. Garbage chances to hit. What's this guy? Well, it's a little better on this guy, though. Let's take a shot at this guy. Roger that. Firing on nice, large hit. Most important thing. Waiting for orders. Ah, uh, granite. Granite. I'm thinking about switching out one of these LRMs for um, the improved ATM. Wow, really? I mean, sure. Engaging with target. We got 18 turns of ammo. We might as well use some of it. Targeting. 
system's janky. Yeah, but I was thinking about switching out the um, one of the LRMs for an, for the improved ATM, just for a little bit of hard hitting power, give us an extra half a ton somewhere as well. But I don't know yet. I gotta see. Uh, somebody, that's a mortar carrier. Do they have reinforcements? Oh, we're fighting Comstar. So there's six of them then. I was not hoping to do this, but it's kind of sucky. Yeah, you run. You run. What do you need? Need you to get up here and get on this uh, cyclone. And if you can't do that, move up into the trees. Get a little bit of defense in case they decide to shoot at you. Wow. Yeah, it's not even well. We got lots of uh, ammo. I'm taking the shot. Ah yeah, well. Okay, so this cyclone and then one other guy. Oh, there we go. Nice try. All right. Who do we want to take out first? Maybe this guy? Minor damage, Commander. Nothing to see. Good to go. Yeah, you say that. Nothing to see here. On the move. Full speed. All right. 30% with the LBX. 20 over here. A little bit better over here with everything. Let's keep the pressure up on this guy. Ooh, nice. Got past the armor. Reporting. Critical hit. Okay. Um, Commander. We want to get these two guys down here, I think. So let's work on doing that. I was thinking about activating the vehicles there, but I'm like, ah, it's probably a bad move at this point. I mean, it would give them something else to shoot at, but... Um, that guy's got a lot of close range weapons. Not a lot, but a few of them anyway. I don't want to get too close to him. So let's, um, because if we activate now, we'll have some other guys that these guys can shoot at, but... Ah, really terrible. Hmm. Really. Man. Well, copy that. Get over this way. Give us a good visual of the battlefield here. Okay, now can we see that mortar carrier? There it is there. Okay. I think we try oh this is a nice chance to hit. We'll take that. Um Yeah, we'll put a beacon on him. Question is, do we use all our LRMs on that mortar carrier? I don't think we do. We gotta split up. So he's only gonna hit one person. Because if we use the LRMs on him, we're not gonna get enough damage. Like, it'd take us three turns to kill him, probably. Uh huh. So that's the guy right down in front. Or is it? Yeah, it is. Going on 16. When do we go? 14, 13, 10. Wow, initiative's terrible. Okay, at least he's giving us his side still. Yeah, this guy's down behind the hill. Hopefully he drives up. We'll see. We shall see. Ok, 
Okay, he's moving in. That's interesting. So if we put the vehicles on this guy, we might be able to take his side. If he's, I don't know if he's running an XL engine or not, though. Two Thunderbolt fives. I don't know if he if he is. He's pretty close to taking that torso though, and he's given us his left side, so we might be able to at least take it. If not. We'll see. Yeah, good luck with that. Light damage, Commander. Six chevrons of evasion plus stealth. Good luck. This is the thing I don't like. Alright, not bad. What can I do for you? Let's move over here. Affirmative. And see. Oof. Yeah, we were hit with uh, incendiaries. We're going to go into the red line, but that's fine. We're going to shoot this guy. I want to see if we can get this torso. Uh -huh. Nah, a couple hits. We got a thunderbolt off him, though. There's more where that came from. Ugh. Hey. Hey. Don't worry, we're going to take care of that problem in a second. That heat problem. Scorpion LRM. Hmm. What's the chance on this guy? That's actually pretty good. So we're going to take it. We're going to go against. Use the Ares against the. Um, trebuchet here. Ah! Ah, uh, Commander? We'll get you. Up here. Position confirmed. On this guy. Targeting for an alpha strike. Solid connection Still on that got one. that torso. Orders. Okay, let's get up Location here. Location confirmed. Now, question is, do we shoot this guy? Or do we shoot this guy? This guy, probably. Uh, we better dial that back to one. We've got a longer fight, so... Let's go this route. Wow, missed. Really? Figures. Oof. I'm worried about this mortar carrier. Hopefully it travels up. Uh, that's not going to be in. Moving to position. Yeah, I think we used activating the um, convoy as a uh, last resort here. Oh man, really? Missed that torso, huh? Thought for sure we could have taken that. I only had 14 points total. Yeah. Good thing this mech runs really cool. Yeah, it's got like, the, what, two or three points left? Yes, Commander. Alright, let's get on this guy. On my way. Double let's time. use you as a quick strike. I might be able to get this mech up and around behind the uh, mortar carrier. Uh, yeah, we'll go with the beacon. Damn. Beacon and tag, though. I guess that's better than nothing. Ah, Griffin, man, what are we going to do with that this turn? She's baking. This guy's going. Nope, that guy's going. K 
Can't keep taking these hits. Alright, where are you moving? Come on. Figure it out. It's not that difficult. Huh, that's interesting. That mortar carrier didn't move, did it? Just sat back there. Ow. That cyclone was supposed to be dead this turn. This guy still gotta go. They're all, like, pretty much all going except before us. Okay, he's backing up. Good play. He's keeping his left side to us, though, so we might get it. We might get on him. Maybe I'll lob the uh, LRMs from the, the Griffin. Really suiciding, are you? He is committing suicide. Yeah, it's not good. I'm taking heavy hits, Commander. Yeah, let's activate this convoy. I hear ya. I don't want to do it now, but... Hmm. Okay, let's get up here. I soar! We gotta drop some heat, so should be able to do that with just firing the LR. Wow, really? Let's get some sensors over there. I'll take a shot at this guy. Right, Commander. Just there we go. Just needed one shot in the torso. Want some more? Huh? Okay. Now you, Commander. Uh, it says we're going to overheat, but it's not showing that. I'm going to use the rockets firing everything. Fire. Oh my oh. god. Really? Short range missiles are out. What? No. Okay, let's get over here. Got to keep this guy on the trebuchet. Well, the laser hit the other guy. Nice. Orders? Good chance to hit. Firing on him. Alright, all nice. He missed. That was the LRM Scorp. Yeah. Yeah, we'll fire straight in this guy's back. Let's hope this cluster round hits. Copy that. Nice. There we go. Target destroyed. That guy pretty much committed suicide. Yeah, we gotta get up there with the uh My armor cephalus. Come on. Send me a real mech warrior. Don't tempt fate. Mm, can we get over the hill? Yeah, no, let's put some pressure on this guy. Good to go. Keep the pressure on this guy. I'm gonna turn this off. Save that beacon for later. He's already got a beacon on him anyway, so and firing. Copy that. Alright, not bad. 
Hopefully we can get him next turn. So we got this cyclone damaged. Looks like it oh it looks like we got all his ammo. So everybody's gonna be on that trebuchet this turn then. He's got an ER laser left. Yeah, we must have taken all his ammo. Okay. I don't know if I want this cyclone though. I mean, we get, like, we'll have enough parts probably at the end of this to be able to, to uh, choose them all and get a cyclone as a mech, but I don't think we, I don't think we really want that. I'm here. There we go. Still a strong, uh, strong red line towards this guy. And firing. Yeah, laser hit. Not the right spot, but as long as we can dish, out, dish out a fair bit of damage. Actually, we're just going to stand still and fire. ER is up. And we'll leave this off for now. Here it comes. Ah, laser missed. Okay, we got his medium lasers. Another hit like that, and you're toast. Do we get both or just the one? Probably just the one. That's the vehicle. Oh, took a hard hit there. This Talos has got no armor left. What do you need? Okay, that's a broken line. That's a broken line. There we go. Acknowledge. Looking to target the uh, trebuchet here. And firing. Okay, I'm on it. Okay, starting to get some good crits on him. Badass. Ready for orders. Uh, I don't think you need to move. That's actually not a bad chance from here. We'll take it. Fire full compliment on enemy. Okay. <laughs> nice. Oh, he's divided, decided to reveal himself. Came out of that uh, trees too, so we should be able to increase our damage on him. So, is the mortar carrier going before me? It is. Oh, it's kind of moving up the hill a little bit. Man, we're losing so much armor. Orders. All right, granite. So that's the left side. A lot of damage. Let's turn the right more towards the enemy. God, we've taken so much damage already. We better start using double shots here with the uh, ultra. Uh, yeah, fire it all. Shredded. That hit something good. So that should be all his ar his weapons. Yep, he's a stick now. Cool. So they're down to pretty much two guy, three guys. This guy, Cyclone, who we're gonna target next. And then let's get Taser Face right up on this guy. I'm gonna turn so that the scorpion can't do much. If it decides to target me, has, won't be hit in the back. And yep. Firing. Oof. I hear you. Missed with one of them. All right. Um. Let's activate the convoy. I can see if we can draw some heat off of the, uh, draw some heat off the, what's his, the, uh, Talos here. That would probably be a kill. That's the B2. This is the guy we want to get next. But let's fire on this guy. Damn. Ready for orders. Okay. 
Confirmed. Let's drop some heat. Let our vehicles do a little bit of work now. Okay. Time to push a little bit, I think. He's backing up. Hey. Want the other guy. There we go. Man, we're using up so much ammo on these first few guys here. Okay. Ooh, we got the leg. Better. We'll see if they've got... They might not get another lance on this next leg here. They might, they might not. Fuck, man. Okay. Mostly. Now. Well, let's hope we're guarding good vehicles. Receiving you. And it's not like mobile HQ or something like that. Okay, get up here. May have bit off more than we could chew here. Finish these these two guys off the cyclone and the um, the cyclone and the uh, trebuchet. We got to um, just use lasers. Heavy fire here. Yeah, we're all taking heavy fire. Yep. Get over here. I'll do what I can. Let's just try for the leg, why not? Damn, I should have gone cluster. Oh well. Nice. One less person we gotta worry about. Okay. Blocking me, you bastard. Roll to that. Yeah, I probably got to move here rather than running. How much I can do about it now. Alright, firing. Locking on. Okay, we got one on. Went through, so we might... Where did it go through, though? Side or the front? We might be able to drop some lerms on this guy. Side, but it's this side over here. Oh shit, I forgot that. Yeah, well, never mind. Now we're in trouble. <laughs> what was I thinking? <laughs> they got a support lance. 33% of a support lance. What do they got here? Harasser with flamers, stinger. Okay, so it's not so bad. Spider, wasp. Stinger. All right, so not too bad on the second round. What can I do for you? For the second rung of guys. Uh. Let's move the griffin over here. Drop some rounds on this guy. Got it. Oh, I did not expect that, but I'll take it. Bye bye. I thought I was hitting him from the side, but I guess I was hit shooting at him from the front. Waiting for orders. Okay, that's not a bad loadout. We'll take that. Yeah, I don't think you can move because we're not close enough to you. I don't think. Well, maybe you can. Got it. Okay, nice. What can I do for you? Learn 15, beautiful. Let's get these guys into the fight. Time 
to die. Okay. Maybe we can make that scorpion or the uh, spider shy off a bit. Is that a large laser? Is that it? I'm barely scratched. I look like a large laser to me. ER medium laser magna. What no? This fire straight up on this guy. Copy that. Firing alpha strike. Okay, nice. We should be able to pull him down this turn. Hopefully the guy on the ground can go down this turn. Then it's just that Scorpion LRM. Okay, who's up? I hear ya. Okay, another LRM-15 guy. Back up over here. Actually, maybe we should target the guy on the ground. Uh, hmm. 25% on this guy. Man, you don't have a lot of ammo. Hmm. No, I think we're going to go on, uh, not you, on you. We gotta get rid of the guys behind us so we can focus on these guys moving up. Receiving you. Okay. Um fifty-one. Not bad on this guy. Gonna dial it back to one. Yep. Okay, at least it landed. Nice. Got rid of his guardian anyway. See, Cyclone, I don't, it's not, for 30 tons, it's not that bad of a mech with two missile and two laser hard points for most of them. It's actually a pretty good loadout. On my way. Okay, same guy. Nice. Eliminated. Who's up? Waiting on you, Commander. Pair of medium lasers, LRM four and LRM fifteen. Twenty percent in the guy on the ground, eh? Let's back up a little bit. This guy's gonna have to do some heavy fighting here in a minute. But you got a lot of LRM ammo, so let's uh, see if we can plink this guy in the head. Here we go. Scare him off if we can get a hit. We didn't even get a hit. Wow. God damn. That's that uh, scorpion. Okay. Yeah. Don't move. Shoot this guy. Try for the leg. Probably not going to get it, but we're going to give it a shot. Roger. Nope. Managed to get up, did you? God, the Talos got like no armor left. At least the damage is spread around. Okay, who's up? Commander. We taser face. Yep, let's get up here. Gonna start on the scorpion. If we get lucky and double hit the back, could be a kill. Locking on. Well, two good hits though. Okay, good. Good side strike. Waiting on you, Commander. You bet. Gonna try for another side strike here. 
right here. And yep. Time to die. Oh, for fuck's sakes! How did you that far away? We shot our own guy. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> so bad. Hey. It's like yeah, hey, hey is right. The frig are you doing? Don't shoot your own guy though. There you go. Not enough to kill. You didn't expect that. I, why do I talk? Good to go. Why do I talk? Okay. On my way. Moving up here. Guys out of range. Take the best chance to hit. Fire. Roger that. Firing on target. All right, we got three on. Take that. Take that and run with it. Meyer damage, Commander. Nothing to see here. We just need to get one of these guys across the finish line. Just one. 25, 37, 30. Take the best chance to hit and use it. Got it. Strip his armor. Okay, we got just this guy left. He's going on three, so we should be able to finish him up with the vehicles. Talos goes on 14. We use the Talos on him. I'll move down, use the Talos on him, and then we'll get these guys over here. Yeah. You got nothing, you hear me? Oh, they got stuff, all right. Question is, do they got the juice to win this? They might just... I don't know where our evac point is. I have a feeling we... we I mean, depending on what they get in their last uh, lands, we may have to bug out of here. You commander moving out okay 50 percent 30 we'll take the 50 tell me what to shoot nice this guy's got pulse lasers i think yeah okay close the gap a little bit on my way I think we gotta double shot this and try for a kill here. Oh, they both landed. Not enough to get a kill, but we got a head hit there. What's up, boss? Yeah, we'll move up a little bit. Firing. Engage. Come on, bail out, bail out. That hit something good. Nope. We got one more vehicle. One more of our guys. And I think we got one more of the... Yeah, the Prowler still got to go. What do you need? Don't move. Just shoot this guy. Uh, I want to go cluster. I want to see if I can get an engine hit. I'm taking the shot. Nice. Okay, problem one solved. Gotcha. Problem one solved. Waiting on you, Commander. Let's get the prowler up here. Coordinates received. And we'll fire on this guy. Take this. Nice. Both lasers hit. All right, who's up? Yes, Commander. Who else? Oh, it was a CT hit. Of course it was. Well, if it was going to be anywhere, I'm glad it was a CT because at least it's not a one-shot. Uh, at least I'm not one-shotable now, you know? Or, 
You know what I mean, like one of my areas is not one-shottable. Okay, let's go. Alright, not so bad. Gonna shoot this guy. Uh, put the narc beacon on. Hopefully we hit. Yep. Beacon and tag. Nice. Hopefully we can finish this guy up this turn. So we've got a vehicle that goes before him. Two vehicles. And the griffin. So we might get some good shots in on him before he gets out of there. I'm going to move my guys first, and then I'll move the vehicle in. Because I think this guy's got machine guns. Yeah, and SRMs. So we'll use our guys long range first, hit this guy. Then we'll use the vehicle at closer range. Hopefully we can do significant damage at long range that the vehicle can just finish him up. So they got somebody at 18 back there? The Wasp. Alright. No. Let's see if we can get you. Flames on the way, huh? Not here though. Let's get over here. Throw the link up for what it's worth. This guy's almost out of ammo too. It's really gonna depend on what uh let's go this route. What we get in that final lance. Nice. Capacity armor. Critical hits, Commander. What can I do for you? Got it. Okay, bring him into range. Let's get everything on. And here it comes. You betcha. And the big lasers just aren't hitting. Worth a squat. Yeah, critical hit. Good to go. I mean, we've get, we're getting half decent chances to hit, but they're just not hitting. Like we're getting, le like, you know, not averaging 50%, but when we get 50% chance to hit, it seems to be hitting a lot less than 50% chance. All right, let's fire these. All right, some good crits. All right, bail out. I hear ya. More where that came from. Yeah, a little farther away. Right there we go. Uh -huh. Let's get on this guy. And firing. Got it. What can I do for you? Alright, same thing. Moving out. It's our prowler. And here it comes. This should be good. Alright, at least one of the lasers hit. Waiting for orders. Another vehicle. Don't need to tell me twice. We were partially hidden behind here, not much, but a little bit. Now here it comes. Firing everything I've got. Okay, nice. Making some inroads. Yeah, I think we I think it was the right time to activate those vehicles. I mean, maybe one turn later. I mean, we probably could have gone a turn earlier, too, and been just fine if we used them all against the guys that we were fighting the first lance. You know, and just ignored these guys. Yes, Commander. Could probably go either way. Understood. Moving fast. All right, now the AC... 20%. 16... 26% chance with the uh, LRMs. I'm going to hang on to the AC ammo until we have a better chance to hit. Nothing. Yeah. Uh. So we still got our two vehicles back here, those Zorias. It's too bad this guy moved over here. Or was it this guy? Or this guy here? Stinger. He's pretty shredded. Okay, let's get these Zorias up yeah, here. Bye. 
Understood. Moving fast. Okay, taking a shot at this guy. Taking a shot. Okay. Did a bit of damage. Inflicted some heavy damage. I don't know. I don't know. I wouldn't call that heavy. But maybe against the stinger you can call it heavy. Yeah, I was uh, thinking about that uh, poll I posted the other day about LBX versus uh, AC-10. Yeah, you're starting to pen in my armor. Armor blow through. Internal damage. It really is situational, you know? Like, I like the LBX because you can use the cluster ammo, and then pretty much at any range, you're assured of doing at least a little bit of damage. Then you can switch over to slug if you have to. Like at a closer, like, or if you got a better chance to hit, to do good pinpoint damage. But then the AC-10, I mean, you're, it's a little more, I think, in weight. Um, I think it's like one ton yeah. more. But you have the ability to use such a wide variety of ammo with it, like even precision ammo, you know? So you get a better chance to hit with a straight shot. Um, it pretty much gives you the same chance to hit, I think, as cluster rounds do. But you also have the chance to use incendiary ammo, which can be beneficial in certain circumstances. Um, I think Negative they've got damage. a... It's not a slug. It's like a beanbag round now that does like almost no physical damage, but a lot of stability damage. I remember seeing that somewhere. So, I mean, there is a lot of versatility with a regular AC-10. So there's an argument to be made for both. Like, I, I don't know, I think... Ha! Send me a real opponent! I mean, LBXs are nice if you're trying to crit. Like, as soon as you open somebody up, it's nice to be able to I have that, that scatter shot to be able to, to capitalize on those uh, locations that are opened up, you know? Hopefully getting a crit to kill the guy with. But then, you know, having that ability to drop like 30 heat onto a mech too, if you get if you get a chance, is also kind of juicy, so. No sweat. I mean, I guess, like I said, it's just all situational, really. Order. Another thing I love about this game is just there's so many different types of loadouts you can use. Um, do I want to go... All five are on that side. I mean, I guess we could go here. Let's move. Yeah, let's, let's do it. Get some sensors and some eyes on these guys and then see if we can uh, hit this guy. All weapons, go. All right, we got a tag on him. I'm here. Okay, here we go. It's not bad. Going as fast as I can. Alright, so I think we just used the laser here. Oh, I don't know. Those Artemis rounds are pretty good. Let's take it. Okay, it's a start. At least he's panicking. Where do our vehicles go? 12, so he goes before us. I was hoping that we could capitalize on that. Unfortunately, we cannot. Although he is kind of... Waiting for orders. Oh, that's the other stinger. He's backing away. Um, no direct line of sight on anything, but... How are we doing here? What's taking... Oh, this torso. And we're getting mauled. So this is the guy with a lot of damage on him, right? It is. So let's keep firing on him, I think. Nothing. No, it didn't hit. Much to my disappointment. Let's rely on these vehicles again. Coordinates received. They're gonna have to bully their way through. Commence 
Because we sure as hell can't do it. Another hit like that and you're toast. Nah. A few more hits like that, maybe. So he's already gone, that guy. So if we get the rest of the vehicles on him, might be able to bring him down. And then we might, if we can take him down earlier, then we, we might be able to finish this guy off too, which will put them down to three. Yeah. At least they have half decent armor. Good to go. Good to go. G to G, baby. Okay, chance on you is 20. 28. Let's go on this stinger. Best chance to hit. Might as well take it. Nice. When I shoot you. Oh, he'll take it, but he ain't gonna like it. Who do they got left? Oh, the vehicles. Yeah, I was it fi finally able to get to um, doing the opening and the. Uh, animations so I got it on the first three videos I'm not a hundred percent happy happy with the opening yet the timing I feel is still off so I might adjust it again for uh, after the third video I just wanted to get things out so and the music I'm not a hundred percent happy with it's not really music it's just more like a pad with some stuff added into it not really a hundred percent happy on it but um, it's interesting because the original um, Waiting on you, Commander. The original file is a 30 frame per second file. I switched to 60, and the graphics look a little too crisp for my liking, so I might dial it back a bit. Like, I might render it at 30 and then just bring it into a 60 timeline to see how that looks. Let's fire on this guy. All right, Corporal. Not a bad chance. On my way. What do we got on this guy though? Oh, it's, he's indirect. Go directly on this guy then. Firing. Here we go. Yeah, critical hit. Like I figured I was gonna call this the series Inheritance. I just didn't know when I was first doing it. Okay, it's got up here. Going full throttle. I think we got lots of L or M ammo left with this guy. Twenty percent. 20% with the LRM on this guy. How's he doing? Let's keep up the pressure. Okay, now got another heat sink. <laughs> We're starting to lose the audio. Yeah, it's going a little wonky. Let's get up here. Slowly getting ourselves into the fight with these guys. And cluster rounds, LRM firing. Bail out. Nope. Not today. I think we're done our turn, too. Right? All the vehicles have gone. Our vehicles have gone. Yep. Alright, we'll see what happens next time. We should be able to pull down the two... Well, this wasp. Or the two stingers, I guess. Yeah. I was really hoping that one would be down this turn, but... I divided the fire. Yeah, we're losing the sound. Yes, Commander. Uh, so this is the flamers. It's a lot of armor. This guy's got weak armor, but an SRM. So front is where I kind of want to hit him from. Side's not too bad, but it's really shitty chance to hit. Doesn't matter if I get close to him or not because uh, he's so fast he can get close to me if he needs to. Let's stay in the trees though. Let's get up here. Holding off. We're not going to hang this guy out to dry though. We're going to be moving up, so it's fine. All right, we'll use everything on him. God damn it! At least the narks and the and the uh, tags are being consistent. 
So we got Griff on 18, Puka on 18. So we got two guys to go before him. We might be able to get that Flamers vehicle gone. This guy's going on. This guy's going 19, 17. So we got two 18s before him. Okay. It's interesting. I think we take it and try and take this mech out. I think we go after the mech with the 18s. Well, depending on what our chance to hit is, this guy's like one hit away from dying. If we can get a front shot. What can I do for you? But I think it's probably better to go after uh, sweat. this guy here. Uh, yeah, we're going with everything because I got—I need this guy gone. Special? Nice. Nice. Should have run when you had the chance. Hey. Hey. All right, let's sprint it up this way. That's the coolant vent that we don't need. I gotta respect this this uh, pilot. Whoops, my bad. I think that was the VIP summer home, but not my problem. Not my problem. All right, I think we go after this guy because it's the guy that's pretty badly damaged. Okay, a couple hits. We're almost out of ammo with this vehicle. All out. Yeah, it's not... I mean... If this wasn't Comstar, this would have been no problem. He wouldn't run out of ammo. But the extra... You know, it's been four extra units so far. And then we're going to get two more extra at the end. Just a pain... Oh, who's going next? Good to go. All right, Corporal. Corporal. Let's go against that uh, this guy right here. See if we can finish him off. Commencing alpha. Shooting from the front. Why would you hit the front? Right. Not going to happen. Turrets in the side. Now oh, we got one on the front. At least we drew his ire. I wonder what his chance to hit against this guy would be. I think our extraction point, if I'm not mistaken, is over here. Oh, he's moving in. That'll give me the kill. He's giving me the kill. Move up here. Don't need to tell me twice. Let's try and draw this guy's ire. Okay, move up here. Roger. Man, we're gonna have to spend a lot of money to get these things fixed. Uh, I think we leave this off for now. And we'll fire the rest at this guy. Alright, we got him. Nice. Not exactly sure how we got him, but we got him. On the move. Didn't look like we did enough damage to uh, any of the areas, but it was probably a crit hit that did him in. I think we go after this guy. He's got a fair bit of armor. we got to get started on him. Who's up? Alright, now this is the SRM guy, right? So we're gonna shoot at this guy then. Come on, just bail out. Thank you. Well, thank you. Well, thank you very much. There we go. Hope the laser hits. Just want the oh, it's a sorry, the, yeah, cluster round. Confirmed. Excellent. Who's up? Waiting on you, Commander. 
Let's get in front. Keep firing on this guy. This should be good. You once were a vegan, and now you will just be gone. Vegan? Where are you moving? Okay, he's turning his side away. All right. Commander. Yeah, let's not sprint it. Just gonna move over here. See if we can get the f killing blow on this guy. Nope. Because why would we... It's so frustrating. Alright, keep applying damage to this guy. Christ, it's a battle of the will nots here. Uh, let's leave these guys off. Pew! Man, the sound's really getting cacked now. Standing by. You can't save either in the middle of a match, so it's like... Double time. I can't just log out and come back in to get the sound working again. Ah, uh, do we go two shots or one? Let's just go one. We gotta save the ammo. Hey, nice, we landed it. Now, is this guy damaged, or is this minorly? Okay. SRM-2 looks like it's out, so he's just got a medium laser now. Alright. Big miss. Gonna keep pushing the vehicle straight I towards the uh, exit point here. I don't trust you to... Not shoot our own guys. Let's get up in front of everybody. Don't trust you to not shoot our guys. Gotta leave these off. Alright, just fire the two lasers. There we go. Finally. Okay, people. Let's head to the out point. I know we got one guy left, but I'm okay with that. We'll just shoot him as we go. Okay, Prowler, let's get to here. It's got the SRM4, that's why I want to put it in the area he's got a better chance to hit. Nice, got past the armor. Okay, you can speed up. So even if we just keep one turn of ammo left over... Wow, terrible. Because so, these guys are only going to have one chance to fire, I think, before they leave. So, it's just as long as I keep one turn of ammo left, be definitely helpful for us. Okay, a few hits there. Not bad. I didn't think I was going to get that at 7%. But I will take it. And the sound. Alright, firing the cluster. In all so I never did figure out. So I got some weird stuff going on with my record uh, recording sound. I don't know what it is what what it is, but like this the background sound is like always happens to me on jungle maps. On a certain turn, it just starts to go all wonky on me and stays that way. But, um, yeah, the, uh, for some reason my settings keep changing for my recordings, so. Ah, uh, let's throw the Narcon. 
Nothing. Really. Okay, don't run away, because I don't want to chase you down. Move up here and take a shot at one of the vehicles. Or, alternatively, run across us all and take a shot at some of the vehicles. And you're going to run away. Alright, at least you missed. Alright, um... Don't shoot your own guy. 30%, huh? Nothing. That's alright. We'll get him. How many shots does it take? Kill the little wasp. My answer is always the same. One too many. Um. Yeah, I can't. That's fine. We'll move these guys down here. They're almost ready to go out anyway. We got one turn left over, yep. We might, we might get lucky here and pop them out. Pop them with something, no. Nope. Not today. Okay, both lasers. Alright, they both hit, nice. Just bail out, dude. He took the small laser to the head. Okay, drop some more lerms on him. He's unstable now, so he should take a few more hits. Goes his other arm. Beautiful. Alright, I am going to move everybody to the out point, and I will see you in a moment. Alright, here we go. So, if I know this map, and I pretty much do, I think the enemies land here by a dropship. They sometimes show up down here, so we're going to move into a position here. Um, Griffin. Cephalus. Ares. And the Dezorias, we'll put one there. And the second one here. And then we'll drive the vehicles out. We're going to park them in the trees. This should activate it here. Yep. Oh, they're coming down right behind us. Because of course they are. <sighs> Two. This is the LRM-15. Come on. Serum 4s, you can move up there. And LRM-15 will move here. Alright, here we go. Oh. Well, that's our dropship. <laughs> I was panicking. I thought, oh no, it's another dropship. But that's ours. Thank goodness. What do we got here? Okay, a locust. It's another cyclone. Falcon. Another locust. Arctic cheetah. Okay. And a mongoose. So we're going to target the Arctic cheetah. Because clan tech. And, um, yeah, because I think they're going to target these vehicles. We're going to target the Arctic Cheetah and see if we can bail the frig out of here. Uh, you know what? Let's just reserve. See if we can all, we can do this in one turn. I don't want to risk losing the Talos, so... Because I don't have anything to get it back up and running again. So let's see what they do here. Who's going on 19? The guy at the back. Mongoose. So he's a laser. He's a laser goose, probably like... Could have a large and some mediums, or a bunch of mediums, who knows. 
Hopefully he doesn't shoot from my guys. Hopefully. Yeah, they're gonna be target they're gonna be locked on the vehicles. I think this cyclone, the A3, oh it's the ballistic version, okay. That's the guy that tried to melee me and got himself killed. So they're going on 19 again. That's the Arctic Cheetah. Hoping that all of my guys are in range of the uh, extraction point here. Because it would be nice to move up, kill the Arctic Cheetah, and then just extract at the end of the turn. There's no point risking damage anymore at this point, And there's not enough salvage there for me to make it worth my while. Oof, that was a back shot. Nicely done. <sighs> Let's reserve. Reserve. What are we on? 15. I think the Griffins... I don't know, man. That Griffin should move. Damn, look at that. Well, the large laser's in the center torso. So we won't lose the large, but we'll use a, lose a pair of LRM-5s. Oh, we do have the improved ATM that we could put in there, I guess. Okay, I'm gonna reserve again. So they're going, they got two guys on 13 and then their turn is done. So then we can actually, yeah, we're not gonna be extracting this turn though. It'll be next turn. So it's gonna, we're gonna have at least one turn of fighting with these guys. All right. Yeah, I'm pretty sure our extraction's like right here. That's the Falcon. If we miss, we hit our own guy, though. Well. Gotta take the chance. Don't miss. Okay, good damage. Who's up? Prowler. So you gotta reserve. Because I got to get my main guys out of the way here. Uh, okay, steamer duck. Okay, it's a solid blue line. It's not bad. We'll take that on the Arctic Cheetah. Uh, we've got a leg hit on him, so hopefully we can leg him. That would be nice. Okay, those two can reserve. You, so your left side is the worst side. Doesn't matter though. Let's get over here. We just need to get as much movement as possible. Double up the shot on this one. Hopefully we don't hit the Zoria. Okay, that's good damage. We hit the Locust too. Okay, you got to get back over here. Solid blue line there, we'll take that. 
Okay, shooting this guy again. Cluster rounds. Still not enough for the kill. Lost evasive though, that's good. Alright, Griff. Um, oof. That's not bad. We'll take that. We shall take that. Let's give it to him then. Nice. Okay. So we got Puka left. This locust is taking heavy damage. Maybe we just plaster him because he's a lot closer to us. I love how when the vehicles go underneath the mechs, the mechs kind of like pop up and back down again. Yeah, let's go like this on this guy. Okay, we got rid of his left arm. Now, the last ditch effort of these guys. Let's see if we can finish this locust off. I'll feel pretty good if he goes down. Because then it just means we're facing four. Uh, yep. Come on, CT him. Nope. Same thing. Jesus, just take him down already. There we go. All right, last LRM-15. Uh, 5W? Actually, what's probably going to be 0.9 on everybody? Oh, 1.9 in the Mongoose. And the Cyclone. All right, let's go after the Mongoose then. Mongoose is five tons less than the Cyclone, so we have a better chance to pull that down in one turn. But we'll see here. All right, so our vehicles take off now. Yep, there's our extraction zone. Beautiful. See ya. All we need to do is get into the extraction zone. Okay. Yeah, and we reserved too, so we lost a lot of initiative this turn. Okay, so the mongoose is going to go, then we go, then the falcon goes. Uh, I don't know what this guy's initiative is yet. So that I think he's got a large... Large and a medium. Where are you off to? You little bastard. Oh, pulse lasers. Okay. It's even better for us. Spread that damage around, Bubba. Spread it around. Alright, you need to get in the... Uh, get to where the getting's good. Right into here. I think we're going to tag this falcon here. Mongoose is gone, but if we can... This guy's going on 17. If we can scare him off with a bit of hits here. He's got to stun those PPC, man. It's damaged, though, so... Okay, the narc's on, which is good. So now he goes... Yeah, I don't know if the Talos can make... I think it can. I think it can just make it out. If not, it's going to be real short here. And I have no problem not shooting and just, like, bailing out of here. Fuck off. Oof. Okay. Who's up? 16. That's the guy back here, probably. The Chyclone. He's probably going to go for the Talos as well. I bet you he'll come down in here and fire. Oh, no, he's trying to melee. Once again, making the suicide run. For a whole 25 points of damage. Probably could have done way more with his weapons. Who do we want to go after? This guy, probably. If he's going to give it to us, we'll take it. We shall take it. Not bad on that guy, but... A lot better on this guy. Let's just use everything on this guy. 
So he's got two LRM5s, two medium lasers, and flamer and machine guns. Yeah, they gotta take melee out of the game. Well, oh, sorry, I take it back. They need to put an option that you can turn it on or off. Because I've had I've had way too many enemy mechs do death runs like this, where they run and they do a you know a handful of damage, and then they just die, or they run in and they knock my mech over and then they just die. It's really just a suicide run. Because they're nine nine times out of ten they're completely unstable when they get there, meaning that I have excellent chances to hit them. And unless they can finish off my knockdown mech then there's just no point. And most of the time they can't. He bailed out, did he? I mean, I guess that's what they're trying to get them to do is shit a brick and bail out, but whatever. It's only because I got noob pilots. I'm kind of shocked that that guy would bail out because like, he's in the extraction zone, so... Yeah. Suicide. Suicide by melee. Oh crap. <laughs> I can't get out this turn. Um Fuck. That PPC still exists too. It's cause I have to go through the stupid water. I guess we move into the trees. And I am going to do this. Try and get some better initiative next turn. Not a good chance to hit there, and my guy's right there, so we're going to just shoot this guy. Or we're going to attempt to shoot that guy and not do it. Alright, who's up? The last Zoria. Hmm. Let's get to here. I'm interested to see what this backstrike chance is. 30% with a... Yeah. 15 there. Let's just go after this guy and see if we can get a hit on him. It'll be a full, it'll be the full damage. Because there's not enough room for it to cluster. Alright. A little bit of back damage. Alright, who's going first? I guess it doesn't matter since I just freaking reserved... Oh my god, I just did that, didn't I? Man, if I had a dollar for every time I think one thing and do something else, I would be, like, rich. There's nothing worse than, I don't want to say nothing worse than having an ADHD mind, but it's like, your mind is, like, doing what pretty much whatever the hell it wants to do. <laughs> You, you you sometimes have control, and then you sometimes just don't have control. It just does it. Oh, there we go. We're out of here. Beautiful. No more risk to my guys. Oh, f well, Unity crashed, so... Yeah, we get nothing out of that mission. <laughs> hey, it was a fun one to play, though. It was kind of tough there at the end. So, I mean, there's no lasting consequences... Unfortunately, well, it would have been nice to know if we had lost the Zoya or not, but we got it back anyway, so it was a pretty fun mission. So next time, I'm going to try and stay away from jungle missions, because um, it just, I don't know, the sound gets all wacky, and that one just, I don't know, just crashed. So anyway, I'm going to leave this episode here, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, drop a like. If you haven't subscribed, please feel free to subscribe. You can also drop any comments in the comment section down below. Until next time, we'll see you later.